would know what to do and what not to do in that spot. But when you don't know what's going on, uh, it's very difficult to understand what you're facing. And I did, I, I did think that they added some extra powerful weapons in dark mode that would make your life easier. Or something maybe. Yeah, I think that's why it's called Dark Mode. There is some sort of armor and weapons. So, my lords, did you get everything you needed? No, not yet, Lord Varus. We are working on it. There isn't much time. I hope you find it quickly. Really? The weapons make it... <laughs> ah, until you find the whole set. What? The weapons actually debuff you or something? That would be interesting. Like a course or something. Yeah, debuff. Very interesting. Okay, let's go and talk to Clement. Okay. That's a lot of people. Okay, where is the dog? Mr. Shield. Man, yeah, if Iron Man runs, I never understood that much. Uh, I 
the appeal, I mean. But it is a challenge, no doubt. But. Huh? Very instinctive. Not an Iron Man guy. I like to throw myself at the games. Not yeah, not planning beforehand or things like that. Which in Iron Man you more or less have to. Otherwise you can make a mistake very early and you are fucked. Okay, who is this then? What the fuck? My Lord Alistair, I was just hoping I'd see you again. Tell me you found my Gawain. I'm sorry. My brother was murdered. What? Oh no. Gods of mercy, no! Gawain. Worry not. You're still young and pretty. There will be other opportunities for you. My brother has been avenged. Now he can rest in peace. I don't care for vengeance, my Lord. Vengeance won't share my bed. Or offer me affection and security. I can understand that. You're not the only one who misses him, my girl. Okay. Hi, Jason. How are you? It's fine. Sunday morning. Talk to his asshole and see if he can give us the steel. End to end, all right. Clement, you old knight. It's been too long. The pair that make up the famous double-edged sword. I'd been told you no longer fought together. After so many years without a word, I had assumed you were dead. And without the help of Relor, you would have been right in part. Well, my friends, I'm guessing that you're not here for a heartfelt reunion. We need your help, Clement. My help, huh? How exactly? We need your sword. We need to kill someone. And for that, we need a blade of Valerian steel. You've got some nerve. After ignoring me for 15 years, here you are again today, simpering and begging me for a favor? And what favor? To kill a man with my sword. You must take me for a complete fool. Over 30 years, lots of men have coveted this weapon. My answer has always been the same. If you want my sword, come and get it. I'm sorry, my old friend. I'd rather you'd have answered otherwise, but you haven't left us any choice. What? Right, come here. Holy shit. Okay, great, my servers. <laughs> nice to hear that. Well, this is a little odd.
Enough. So the years have not made you weaker. We've got a debt to pay, Clement. My Lord Relor is guiding me in my vengeance. I see. Take the damn sword, then. You've earned it. I'd have thought you'd rather die than be separated from it. In 30 years of combat, you're the first who seems worthy of carrying it. A strong man needs a weapon that befits him. Take it. I know that you'll do it justice. Thank you, my friend. Godspeed. As for me, there's a bottle calling my name. It's my own way of treating my wounds. Well, now that we have the weapon, let's go back and see Varys. It does force you. Uh, if you play on insane difficulty. Insane difficulty is now death. If you die, they corrupt your saves. So I was in my 19th try. Very far into the game. Very, very far into the game. And they stripped me of everything I had built my character around. And sent me to fight a fucking huge demon. And it hit me twice. I died instantly, basically. And that was it. 50 hours wiped out. And I got very annoyed. Yeah, but I don't, I don't, yeah, I don't play game, I play games in the hardest blind to see how difficult they are. That's why I, I, I always compile how many times I die and everything like that. Because I want to see blind how difficult they are, how annoying, how unfair. So, my lords. Did you get everything you needed? We have Valerian steel. Now we must move forward. Very well. Such a weapon requires great skill. Do you think you can make good use of this? If necessary, the metal could be melted down and reforged. I know an excellent smith, a discreet young man, and one of the few capable of forging Valerian steel, but we must be quick. Would you like to have it reforged? Certainly. Tell us where we can find your forge. I don't want to leave anything to chance. Very well. We must make haste then. The apprentice awaits you. You will find him easily. His new master's forge is in the merchant's district. Mm, but The Witcher is a very well made game. Because as a, as, yeah, 19 deaths and I had made it two-thirds of the way that has not happened before no I don't I the problem is that I don't like to replay games I hate to replay games <laughs> I really really hate to replay them Ah, you, you, uh, you either focus on the story a lot or the, the, the combat, uh, it can get distracting, it's very true. But yeah, the problem is that I, I cannot bear to play games twice or thrice. The only game I have played more than once, well, this uh, series. Kothor 1 and 2 and Mass Effect 1 and 2 those are the only games I have replayed but because I played them in the Xbox the Mass Effects and I had to play them in the computer and the Old Republic I, I, I played a long time ago so you must be the apprentice that Varys told us about 
I am. Lord Varys tells me you don't have much time to spare. So show me the famous weapon. It's beautiful steel. I had a few opportunities to see Tober Mott, my former master, reforge weapons like this one. What sort of weapon are you thinking of? But yeah. I I I like to reload and see multiple outcomes, but not replay. Reload I'm fine with, but replaying holy shit. Yeah, it's like a CC, like a CC bodybuilder or something. It's crazy. I'd like to have the steel recast into ranged weapons for us. Very well, my lord. I'll make the weapon and missiles of your choice. What type of weaponry are you thinking of? Uh, arrowheads, I'm guessing. I need a sturdy bow and needle-sharp arrows. Consider it done. I ask for a arrow, he's forging ah he's melting the sword, yeah. Okay. Here, this should be enough to kill a whole garrison. Is it to your liking? Completely. Okay. Yeah, I understand, that's why I don't replay. You have to in order to truly truly uh, experience something different you have to replay the game from the very beginning it's the only way <laughs> Damage plus 200 against shadows, okay. Okay, I think it's just time to change them up and see what happens. No, there is no alignment. Not visual at least. No, no visual alignment. And talk to Arris. Oh, 
But yeah, I don't like to replay because I invest too much into the story and the character the the throughout the game, let's say. Uh, So when I experience the game, I think I have experienced it. Holy shit, that music is crazy. Well, I can't, I can't tell you this character is going... Going very ruthless, very crazy. So he has realized that his religion after all is uh, a <laughs> reality, it's not just bullshit for the masses. There is something that's causing him to perform magic. This guy on the other hand has rediscovered religion. And the love of people. So he has trended more to being a, a trusting guy. Well, this one has trended towards being a deceiving guy. Fine. Now that the problem has been solved, there is one last detail that needs taken care of. The child. What do you plan to do with him? I failed to protect Jane. But I will not fail to protect her child. He will stay with me. We will be going up against Valar, Mors. You and I both know the risks the child could be exposed to in the midst of the fighting. Jane's son, Robert's bastard, must live. I may have a solution. I could take the child with me. Unlike you, I may enter the Red Keep without difficulty. Once you have found Valar and carried out your vengeance, I will bring him to you. I fear we have no other solution. You have already saved my life once, and I trust you. Do not disappoint me, Lord Varys. I'm warning you, Varys. Any tricks and you will pay dearly. And believe me, you do not want to find out why they call me the Butcher. Why would I provoke the anger of such a fearsome warrior as yourself? Have no fear. I will protect the child and bring him safely to you. Very well, Harwin. Your work here is done. You should now hasten back to Riverspring to manage your household affairs. Very well, Lord Alistair, but I beg you both to be cautious. Now, if you will, I suggest that we quicken our pace. You haven't yet revealed your wondrous plan to get us into the Red Keep. But you already know the plan, my friend. It involves a place you visited just recently. The tunnels! Exactly. There is an entrance deep in the sewers. You won't miss it. I've lit a lantern that sheds a purple light throughout the tunnel. I will let you find your own way. Meet me there, and I will wait for you at the entrance to the tunnels. There is a passage link in the cellars of King's Landing to Magor's tunnels, through which you can infiltrate the Red Keep. Go and find it. Oh, certainly I will! All right. I think this one is quicker. And this will be a nice test.
Shit. Damn, go so well. <laughs> Fire! <laughs> okay. Before I could revive that guy. What? 